The first phosphate, Bejan La Marche property, is situated in the Saguenay Lac Saint Jean region of Quebec, Canada. The property is at 40 kilometers from the major urban city of Alma and 265 kilometers from Quebec City, the capital of Quebec. The property has excellent fully paved road access to major industrial infrastructure in the area. The international deep sea port of Saguenay, Quebec, is located at 70 kilometers driving distance from the property, while Heberville Station, the North American Intermodal Rail Shipping Terminal, is 55 kilometers away. The company has strategic agreements in place to be able to access both of these key transportation hubs in the area. The property is also situated at 80 kilometers from First Saguenay, the site of the company's future lithium iron phosphate powder production facility for convenient vertical integration of mining and downstream value-added operations. Major resource company Rio Tinto operates five major aluminum facilities and six hydropower plants in the region. For this reason, the Bejan La Marche project benefits from close proximity to major industrial suppliers, a well-trained industrial workforce, and several industrial parks in the region. The Bagotville Regional Airport Hub and associated NATO Air Base are located at 55 kilometers driving distance from the property. The Mashtuyash indigenous community with which First Phosphate is partnered is located at about 100 kilometers from the site. Lastly, a recently announced 3000 megawatt wind power project in the region is planned at only 150 kilometers from the property. Once completed, this should become the second largest wind energy project in the world one which should require a tremendous amount of energy storage capacity based on lithium iron phosphate battery. All these unique features make it such that the Bayon La Marche property is an extremely strategic and advantageous site for the company's eventual mining operations. The Bayon La Marche phosphate deposit is comprised of three zones with mineralization that starts at surface, descends to an average depth of 250 meters and remains open at depth. There is the mountain zone, the northern zone, and the southern zone. The mountain zone grades at about 8.3% high purity igneous phosphate. The northern zone grades at about 7%. The southern zone grades at about 5.5%. The average over the three zones is about 6.2% high purity igneous phosphate. All three zones of the deposit are open at depth, as can be visualized in this diagram, which details the full pit shell that comprises the resource. Furthermore, the highest grading mountain zone has been drilled only to very shallow depth to date, and as such possesses extensive growth potential down deep. The total length of the mineralization of the Bejan La Marche deposit is about 2.5 kilometers. The mountain zone is composed of one large mass of very high-grade phosphate, while the northern zone is comprised of two separate layers, the largest of which is about 300 meters. The southern zone is comprised of four layers, three of which display equal thickness, while the fourth is of greater girth. All three zones comprise inferred resources of 214 million tons of high-purity igneous phosphate, grading at 6.0%. The mountain and northern zones contain an additional 41.5 million tons of indicated resource of high-purity igneous phosphate, grading at a 6.5%. The company's mineralogical test work has been able to concentrate the raw phosphate ore to 40.8% phosphate content, P2O5, at a 91% recovery rate and devoid of deleterious elements. This is some of the highest grade phosphate concentrate ever attained by way of feedstock purification. The company has been able to convert over 90% of this high purity phosphate feedstock into battery grade purified phosphoric acid. Metallurgical tests have also shown that a magnetite concentrate and an ilmenite concentrate can be produced during the phosphate extraction and concentration process. The magnetite iron has been concentrated to 98% pure magnetite, 
and tests are ongoing to convert this feedstock into high purity battery grade iron powder. Lastly, the ilmenite titanium has been converted to a saleable medium grade titanium concentrate feedstock. Both phosphate and iron are major elements required in the production of cathode active material for lithium iron phosphate LFP batteries. Titanium is also a component used in battery production. All three of these elements qualified in the company's mineral resource estimate, phosphate, iron, and titanium, are listed on the Quebec and Canadian critical and strategic minerals lists. Please visit firstphosphate.com for further information and for all of the company's latest news and project stages and details.